Hey folks, welcome to the channel. I'm Don. This is Rock in a Country. Hope you're having a good day. We're still at it. We do non-pop country music reactions around here. You saw the title, Patsy Klein's A Church, A Courtroom, Then Goodbye. Alrighty, I guess the church is where you get married, the courtroom is where you get divorced, then you say goodbye. Been there. Uh, and this was suggested by Jeff Cather. So Jeff, shout out to you, my friend. Jeff had his people send me this shirt because Jeff is in country radio, has been for about 40 years or so. Had a band back in college. I re reacted to a song or two of his from back then. So let's see what Patsy's got for us. Yeah, and if you wonder if this is country, it is. Was the church, then the altar. Yep. Where we claimed each other with tears of joy, we cried. I love that moment. Our friends wished us luck. There forever As we walk from the church Side by side The next scene was a crowded courtroom And like strangers we sat side by side Oh, what a line judge make his decision and no longer were we man and wife yeah i know that feeling man that anybody who's gotten divorced knows that what a perfect way of saying that and like strangers sat side by side that took me right back to my courtroom, too. We weren't fighting with each other. We were just we were getting divorced. That was her decision. After a while, you just give up the fight. You just, what do you get? If somebody doesn't want to be with you, they don't want to be with you anymore. But damn. Damn. Hmm. Plenty of time to feel the pain right here. again we cried. You do. Then it was the end of our story. A church, a courtroom, and then goodbye. Jesus God. You talk about a song that perfectly captures, it's more than a sliver of life here. I don't, I don't know. I don't, just sometimes, you know, you just, something just captures something so perfectly. Uh, you relive it. I remember the goodbye, my, you know, with my, my ex, the goodbye. It was right out of like a, a Hollywood movie, not with a happy Hollywood ending, but we're, you have to sit, we sat in the lobby, you know, after it wasn't a contested divorce. It wasn't acrimonious. And in, in I mean, originally, of course, I fought for her to stay, but that wasn't 
to where she was at with the relationship for whatever reason. She just wasn't into it. So anyway, then you go in the courtroom, just like they said, you sit side by side like strangers and you don't hate each other. You, you hate what's happening, but you don't hate each other. You still love each other. That doesn't go away. I mean, there's that seed of love in you for that other person that if you honor that you love that person originally, then you won't kill that seed off, but you're not, there's, you may not like the other person in some ways any longer because of what's going on. But then the judge, you know, stamps it, asks a few questions, and then you go wait in the, in the, basically the lobby. And he says, you know, the, the clerk will bring out each of your copy of the divorce decree and that took about 20 to 30 minutes. So it's kind of awkward there. You're just waiting for it. And instead of having something, the thing you have in common is that you're splitting. So there's a contrast. But then I remember going down in the elevator together and her car happened to be parked in a different part and a different street opposite mine. So when we walked down the sidewalk, we were truly saying the final goodbye at that moment. And I still remember we just sort of turned and looked at each other just to say goodbye. And, and I couldn't talk. I was too choked up. And same thing for her. So we just hugged. She has her divorce decree in one hand. I've got mine in my, in my hand. We just sort of hugged and then turned. And this is the Hollywood scene and walked our separate ways. And that was it. And the songs like this just bring you back to whether they're great moments in life or crappy moments in life, they, this. So anyway, that song's a 10, people. They're, this song was flawless. I mean, it was just so well produced, so well done. That, that There weren't too many lyrics in it. You had that moment in there, that moments. You had that stretch of just instrumentation of just you could feel the, the moment. And they let you do that instead of loading you up with lyrics um, all the way through. Um, just, wow. So, Jeff, thank you for that suggestion, my friend. Good Lord. That goes in the playlist of songs of 10. Uh, 10, what can I say? Have a great day, guys. I'll see you in another video. Keep rocking the country.